The chemistry of this atmosphere is unlike that of any other. Any other. Hello and welcome everyone. I'm Andrew Fields, head coach of the Northwest Northwest Jaguar football program. I would first like to thank all of you, parents, fans, alumni, and community members for supporting us on Friday, September 5th in our win against the Whitman Vikings. We had several players who played exceptionally well, Ashton Foster, Deontay Joppe, Drew Tripko, Brandon Myers, Hassan Dixon, all performed well above our expectations. And the rest of the team, in general, played well, at least acceptable enough for a win. Saturday morning's film review, however, pointed, pointed us in the direction of improvements, and that's something we'll certainly be working on this week. Speaking of this week's schedule, Monday, I'd like to just give you the schedule for the week so that everyone's aware and on the same page. Monday, before practice, we will have helmet awards, giving out superlatives for the game against Whitman. After practice, we'll be presenting the game plan to our kids uh, and players, and they should be prepared to be at the school probably until about 8 o'clock on Monday night. On Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, prior to practice, we'll be having our uh, study hall. That study hall will go from 2.25 p.m. to 3.25 p.m. During that time, students will be have the uh, luxury of several computers at their, at their disposal, as well as the ability to see teachers around the building, go to the library, do a lot of different things to enhance their academic performance. After practice on Tuesday is our uh, weight room session. That will be after practice, immediately after practice at approximately uh, 5.45 p.m. On Wednesday after practice, we'll have our weekly position meetings with our position coaches. And on Thursday, we'll have our always enjoyable special event night. That special event will be announced tomorrow for the entire team. On Friday, September 12th, we'll travel to Seneca Valley High School for the 10th annual Battle for the Germantown Kings Trophy. Now this battle goes back 10 years, really to 1998 when Northwest opened uh, and pulled kids away from Seneca Valley High School and at that time the rivalry began. Right now the series is ahead for Seneca Valley 5-4 to four, but it's our intention Friday night to even that series up. Seneca Valley boasts a glorious tradition, a superlative history, great coaching staff, great players. Uh, between their coaches on that staff they probably have 30 state championships. It's our uh, goal this week to make sure that our kids, players, fans, alumni are ready to go Friday night and make sure that we are in a position to win that football game. It's going to take an effort from everyone. Let's make sure we're in it together, all for one.